strike of a light bulb. I just air it out and leave with the mic broke. Your micro, I'm hard body like Tyco. Heavy metal Chevys with nitro. Addicted to the vapors of paper. Hypnotic to the thirst. I'm pulling off criminal capers. I know the cocaine crackery stinks, but that's what it is. Surrounded by the khakis and mints. We move. Hmm. Miss Gears may be in league. Oh, and here's the single greatest is. animation. Yeah. Who knew? Right yeah. Here. She always seems so sweet and innocent in her videos. Well, except for that one with the. You know. What the hell? Oh, right. And if we win that grand. That's some amazing camera work on that one. Oh yeah. We'll get another chance yeah. to talk to her. And we never do stuff like that. So. Oh, dude, the actual taxi. The actual taxi. Oh man, I haven't seen you in a while, boy. Yeah, start working on getting off this thing. All right, let's see if I can do it. Swing your wrench, throw the wrench. That's always a good one. I think it's pretty bulletproof, man, after three games. You know how they uh, how they actually keep you on this? They draw a, a spline around this area and if Ratchet tries to go off the spline, it just doesn't let him. I mean, until it parks, you know? Right. Oh, are you serious? All right, I'm just gonna cut that out of the video. So, uh, uh, let's see, I think that's it for this level, right? Unless I went back and did the- uh... You didn't finish the torsos, did you? No, I didn't. Do you want me to go back and do that? Uh, I mean, you could. Okay. You don't have to, I guess. No, let's give it a try. You can mock me for how bad I am at this. You are pretty bad at this. All right. Uh, so Wait, th let's... there's a rocket launcher. Why are you not buying the rocket launcher? Because we don't have enough money. It costs 150 grand. Oh, shit, that's grand. expensive. Yeah. Wow. I, I think I need to go back to... Well, we got a bunch of new Annihilation Nation missions right now. So I can go back and farm for it. Maybe off camera. Do you, do you think we should do, uh, like, after this, another Annihilation Nation episode, or uh, or skip to whatever's after it? I think we should just we could keep moving forward. Yeah, because we're... I mean, there there's some mandatory Annihilation Nation missions. Maybe we can just do the mandatory one. Yeah, probably. Do the rest off camera. Yeah, that sounds good. Do you have anything else to say about... Uh, Not really. I mean, uh, I, I'm kind of out of... Clever quips. <laughs> really, the only reason we're doing this is to watch me fail. Then, at this point, we can talk about things that aren't related to Ratchet and Clank. We can see, we can see how compelling we are when we're not talking about Ratchet and Clank. We just test our audience. Okay. What to do see you see? How long they're willing to stick with us? I don't know. Uh, have you seen Avengers yet? No. Because you should see Avengers right now. Why should? What is wrong with you? What's uh, What's great about Avengers? Everything is great. Well, not everything is great. The last 45 minutes are great about Avengers. Okay. And, the and first it, hour and a half is kind of like, ah, whatever. Does it but make, the last 45 minutes are unbelievable. Does it make you forget that you hate Joss Whedon? Uh, yes, actually it does. Really? The last 45 minutes are really well. So and all, of the, all of the crazy quips are all right? No, the quips are terrible. He, there's so many of them, and they're unending. It's just this unending stream of quips. So for those of he, you who don't know, Tony really objects to... How clever all the characters are in Joss I, Whedon. Okay, we're going to talk about this right now because this is actually my big complaint about And other people have shared this complaint with me, which <laughs> proves that I'm not crazy. I've had this conversation plenty of times with people. All right. That there's not a single scene in Avengers that doesn't end on a joke. Every single scene ends on a joke. And it is exhausting when every single scene ends on a joke. It's just incredibly exhausting. It's bad pacing, right? That's and he can't control himself. It's he's just unable to control himself on this in this one. Uh, and I've had some people agree that's a gigantic boot. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? It's oh, it's the charge boots. Okay. It's the charge boots. It's a non-essential segment. Uh, yeah. So so uh, so you don't like quips? I don't like that they're unending, and I don't like that they just it's it's just constantly in your face. That everybody's always ending on a joke. Even dramatic scenes end on jokes. It makes no sense. <laughs> All right. They'll have a dramatic scene, end it on a joke, and then cut right back to it being dramatic. <laughs> it's like, what is wrong with you? So uh, uh, everybody write in the comments about how much you hate Tony for hating Joss Whedon. Yeah, that's fine. Go ahead. And, do it. And do please, you do. please let us know 
how not compelling we are when we're not talking about Ratchet and Clank. I will say this though, to give the guy credit, uh, I saw Cabin in the Woods. I actually have zero complaints about Cabin in the Woods. Really? I will give him that. He didn't direct it, and I don't know how much he did on the writing, but he his involvement didn't screw it up incredibly, which is a big step up. Wow, that's progress then. It is. All right. He's moving forward. Maybe we can get you to watch Dr. Horrible next. He might actually have a career that Joss Whedon, <laughs> after his $1 billion movie. Maybe there's some hope for this guy. You, you heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. Tony says Joss Whedon may be an up-and-comer. That's right. Maybe a future for the guy. So, uh, for Ratchet and Clank developer commentary, and apparently Avengers uh, non-developer commentary, <laughs> uh, my name is Mike Stout. And I'm Tony Garcia. And that's and it. we'll see you next yeah. time. Go, go. <laughs> I like yours better. Yeah, we're done. Yeah. I guess this is over. Yeah, screw you guys. We're going home. That's the end of the episode. <laughs> Finished. That's how we'll end all of them now. I'm Tony Garcia. Finished. Yeah. I, done. And I'm Mike Stout. Fuck it. <laughs> Oh shit, there's a, there's a cutscene here. Hey, Ratchet, what's up? Hi, Skid. Can we talk to Sasha? Sasha and Quark are meeting with the president, man. They left me in charge of the ship. What? Uh, I mean, I see. Uh, well, is Al there? He's out to lunch. Helga? In the sauna. Quark's monkey, perhaps. Just tell Sasha that Clank and I are checking out a lead on the Obani moons. The Obani moons? Sounds like you guys could use some backup. I'll grab my gear and meet you there. I don't know, no, no. no. <sighs> Great. <laughs>